I am Rajiv Tanayandu, CEO of Chaman of Sharp Credit House Private Limited. It is a subsidiary of uh, Sharp Print Holding Private Limited. And under this, uh, we have Sharp Credit Card, this is for commercial printing. And Sharp Print Export is an export arm of the company. And also packaging Sharp, packaging Private Limited, that is for uh, totally on packaging. And also recently we have started uh, the idea factory that is for stationery and notepads. I was born in Chilau and my school is uh, St. Mary's, Chilau. And after that I was uh, to the university and I graduated in Sri Jayavadhapura University, BCom. While working, I got an opportunity to uh, working in the bank. So I was a banker for 25 years. Somewhere in 97 I started this business with my wife and uh, I completed 25 years banking and uh, started functioning as a CEO of the company. Due to the recent past we have developed our company machinery and other mm -hmm. things to meet the uh, world standard. Right? Recently we started exports also and in a way we have uh, supply to many exporters in Sri Lanka. Mm -hmm. So we consider as mainly as an indirect exporter. And uh, we have recently bought a new machine and we upgraded the whole machinery. Mm -hmm. So likewise, uh, during the next three to five years, we are planning to reach to the top level as a printer. In the present scenario, uh, commercial printing in the world, over the world, commercial printing margins out. Everybody needs to get a very low cost price. While the uh, quality standards remain the same, they are trying to get the very, very competitive price because of that reason our margins are getting eroded. Uh, so that's the present challenges uh, we have for any printer. Mm -hmm. So in order to face the challenges, uh, as I said, uh, recently we have started the idea factory that is for stationary market. So we have developed our own brand. In the past, I have visited some countries like USA and uh, UK and other Eastern countries mm -hmm. also. I saw that uh, there are so many brands. In mm -hmm. Sri Lanka still, uh, so I can see many brands in Sri Lanka, many good brands. Mm -hmm. So my challenge is to develop this brand in the next few years. Actually, with regard to risk, I am always taking risk. I am a risk taker. Uh, normally, I take risk uh, at all the time. Uh, I take the risk uh, with, ca with proper calculation. So, I, in short, I take uh, calculated risk. Success is, uh, I dreamt something few years back, which I have been make reality now. So, I believe that uh, if, uh, if anyone can think something, and we can achieve it. So that is uh, success. I think. After I achieve that, uh, I believe that is a success. Mm -hmm. Teamwork, normally I like teamwork. Like teamwork, so uh, for everybody I call as a team team member. But even the marketing headman guy or uh, very small worker. So I I have given the feeling that uh, they should be part of the team. Mm -hmm. Even I do a very one step sometimes. And to achieve the organization goals, uh, so anybody in this organization is a team member. So they have to work towards the goal. Mm -hmm. Each and every member, I have given him a chance and I have given him an opportunity uh, to do work, that means I have given the objective, this is what we have to do. So as a team player, so he is working to achieve the task somehow or another. So I get the result ultimately. Normally I don't say no to anybody, because, but uh, I have learned that there are some instances where I have to say no. So in banking life also, I, I learned that, I have to say a certain so there are some instances where I have to say no, but still I can practice that, right? But I have faced the difficulties also without very hard work, I am trying my level best to do that. Uh, finally I thought I, I should have said no, but still I couldn't follow it. Recently we have started uh, fire system, Japanese fire system. 
under that uh, we saw that a lot of uh, some improvements are there. Only thing is, it is very difficult to train our guys to adhere to the that system. That is a difficulty, one of the difficulties I have. But I, or, in overall, uh, the little improvement, that, the improvement I have noticed and experienced, I can see that if I improve, if I implement more in fire system, I can get, I can achieve better performance, I can get a better results. First thing is I, I can motivate people, that is one thing. Another thing is, uh, the main thing is, uh, I'm a risk taker. I, I have some dreams all the time, so I'm developing my dreams <coughs> all the time. Uh, so I'm, I'm following that dream, so somehow or another, and achieve that. I'll do easy things first, and I prioritize the most important things. As I said, easy thing first, mm -hmm. and after that, most uh, important things. Mm -hmm. And uh, likewise, uh, it's most economical and most uh, advantage. And so I calculate the risk also. Mm -hmm. So how I can risk, I put the risk. As a banker, I'm always uh, keep in mind, keep my mind that uh, the risk involved in all this. Well, I estimated. Um, Marketing, marketing this thing, but after that, uh, in the current context also in Sri Lanka, not, not only Sri Lanka and all the world, that uh, our margins are getting eroded, our prices are getting down. Mm -hmm. So sometimes I made a mistake by overestimating the sales target and all these things. But anyway, from time to time, uh, before I go into big trouble. Where I can, from the experience and uh, professional quality, uh, uh, academic and everything I learn. Uh, so before I go in trouble, I always try to come up and the recent uh, new business also we started to face the challenges and before I go into big trouble. So I thought uh, I must do this and come up. Actually, the first thing is uh, we should be able to see the future very clearly. Right? And uh, as I said all the time, so uh, as a finance uh, person, right? finance person, I should calculate the risk for every any uh, any action as a financial reaction. Right? And because of that reason, we have to analyze the risk and we have to calculate the risk. Then only we have to take in this motto is if I can think something I can achieve it. That is uh, first I have thought towards development sometime I feel uh, I have to do more on uh, managing our time. Right? So still I'm due to heavy workload uh, anyway we have to personally we have to develop the skill managing the time. Mm -hmm. So then we can do a lot of works. And end of the day, we can be happy. <laughs> Balancing all personal life and uh, my profession, that's very important. Family is very important. I was in the bank for 25 years. Uh, then I was in the bank, I mean, uh, after working in uh, the 90s, early, yes, early 90s. Uh, I worked in a SMI section, project finance. There I I was engaged in financing small and medium term industries. I, vis I, vis I visited, I traveled many areas in Sri Lanka. So I was, I was working in the People's Bank, that's my division. There I, were, I meet customers and I, I assisted them and the a lot of industries. And also uh, we had uh, in, yes, in the past, we have, I have financed many uh, garment industries. There I thought huge garment industries, about 200, uh, 200 garments nationally. And uh, there I, uh, I decided I should be an entrepreneur one day right, while I was banking. And um, then I have to get capital for that. Right? So, but uh, after that I thought if I have some vision, so that can be achieved. So I started this business very small, 
scale. But, um, one computer and few tables. A right, few tables and now so we have 100 workers, about 500 million assets. And also one, one more thing I had to add, uh, while I was uh, engaged in financing customers, so I learned the way thing is before I got into trouble, that is what I got uh, very less uh, inst instances where I got in trouble. Because uh, when when I, I was uh, I was functioning as a branch manager, then I finance uh, many customers. Then I had a opportunity to see how they uh, how they went wrong and how they succeeded. So with that, I got very good opportunity to get those uh, instances to success of my uh, business. Thank you. Thank you very much. Backed by the education. That's very important thing. And uh, my behind my success I, that is there. I with the knowledge I did. So success is a knowledge. Yes, success is that. And the education. So you can if you know the subject very well, you can do good business. Thank you very much for this message.